I just can't get enough of that Donkey Kong. So here we are again, Vine Valley. It's my second recording session to listen one day. Uh, Vulture Culture. Yeah, I just still uh, kind of felt like playing, so here we go. This is obviously the forest world. Where forests grow on forests. And uh, I want to kill this guy. Let's just switch the ditty. For practicality's sake. And then jump on this like pile of leaves or something. I don't know, I never really got what that was. I think I can move this over here and jump up there and yeah, there's a bonus. So here you gotta hit the letters in the order they flash. And I think you're not supposed to hit the crumbling heads. I don't know why else it would be there. And there's our second ostrich, so... Diddy throws his hat up in celebration and we move on through the level. So, here's a barrel. It's pretty great. It's pretty much just for that guy to spit the thing into and I died. Awesome. Okay, so, uh, the lesson here is don't, uh, don't try and move backward when you're heading towards the ledge you're supposed to go to. Only idiots do that. So this does mean that we will get our third vulture and we will do the bonus round. So that's cool, a bit of a waste of time, but whatever. So I'm apparently keeping these things very short. I don't know. I don't know why I'm suddenly trying to do that, but anyway. Yeah, there we go. Third ostrich. Doesn't take that long to do the bonus round. I think it will make us do the level over again, though. I mean, we barely got through it, so that's not a big deal, but still. I hope this, uh, the game sound isn't too loud. It's kind of loud for me. I just want it to be audible. Like, you know, audible enough to hear all the music and stuff clearly. And my voice always comes out louder than I expect it to, so... You know, that, that shouldn't be a problem. So, yeah, now we're just getting more of these. I don't know if I mentioned this before, but I'm not sure if the doubles thing accounts for the ones you get after you get that, or just the ones before. Either way, I think uh, this is plenty. I'll get a good amount of lives from this. Let's see, one, two, three, four. I kind of carry that on like I was expecting another, but... I really was not. Yes, just go forward, don't try to go back and hit the other vulture. That's what you should always remember. Does this lead to a bonus? It does. Alright. Here's another kind of bonus. You jump on these guys, they spit out bananas infinitely. Not infinitely, just... Uh, for a pretty long time, and after a while you get a prize. Doesn't require a whole lot of explanation. I don't want that. There we go. Oops, let's just shoot forward. These guys are dropping nuts or something, I don't know. I don't know what they're dropping. Acid. Ha ha ha. Yeah, <laughs> moving on and getting hit by a nut. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of jumping on vultures and getting hit by nuts. What's with the vulture spitting nuts? I don't even understand that. That makes no sense. And it's funny because video games aren't supposed to make sense. Someone in the comments will be like, Do you expect a game with like walking monkey tie wearing ape things makes sense? That was a horrible description. But uh hopefully you get the point. No, I probably just sound insane. Anyway, yeah, more barrel fun. Uh, I want to jump off this ledge. That was really bad timing. <laughs> Jumped right when he threw a thing. Anyway, yeah, that's what I wanted to jump off for, so I can do this, another mini game. That's mini games in this level. And I think I'm getting them all. There's the end. <laughs> Would have laughed if I hadn't made it to the end there. 
just decided to screw up on the very last barrel. There we go, there's the G. That's the end of that level. There we go. That wasn't so hard, I'm gonna lower the sound a little bit because it's too loud for me. 48. Perfect number. Treetop 10, alright. I always like this level because, uh, I don't know, I like this whole treetop village thing going on. Anyway, yeah, here's the first bonus. What you gotta do here is just wait for the right timing. I don't know. I don't really need to explain it, do I? You get the letters in the order, you get a free life, that's it. I love how Diddy celebrates while Donkey just stands there staring at the ground. Yeah, lots of the uh, barrel cannon stuff going on in this world. That was lucky. <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, just lots of barrel stuff. And there's the K, so we're not even that far into it. So I like about this, I can get it done fast, so long as I'm playing decently. There we go. Get that. Oh. Well, that shouldn't have happened, what? And I was lucky, I was supposed to time that, but I just kind of hopped in there with reckless abandon. Yeah, that's how you die. Um, it's pretty great. Now, uh, now you actually have to, like, look ahead. So they're really getting crazy with us here. You have to, like, plan ahead to do the right timing. Let's put Diddy back in charge. Like right there, I was supposed to hop in that when the barrel was in front of the barrel, so I would hit it. But, uh, I just happened to get it at the right moment. Without trying to. That was neat. Oh god, I'm screwed. Yeah, there's one point in the level where they have, like, a big barrel blasting machine thing, but if you... If you, uh, fail, you just get sent back to the beginning of it, so it's, it's more forgiving. Anyway, what I really need to do here is, uh, be more conscious of enemies and stuff, because I keep just, like, running around, barely avoiding them. And these guys, kind of annoying. Uh, I didn't expect those to come out. Yeah, here I gotta do then, so I land in the barrel. And these things aren't auto-fire, so it's okay. I kinda want the G, there we go. Oh, I didn't get the N, so it doesn't matter, yay. Let's get the ostrich. And let's see, I have a treetop town, that wasn't so bad either. So now we go down to Forest Frenzy. Where, uh, we're in the forest and there's quite a frenzy, including ropes and other things. How did that work? That was his head. That's kind of like in the Super Mario world when stuff comes up underneath you and you get hit for no reason. Like I talked about that in one of my recent Mario episodes. Yeah, speaking of Mario, I lost a bunch of footage of that. I'm gonna have to re-record it. Let's get the K just for fun. Bananas in pajamas are hiding from these gray Kremlings. I don't know what that bell is for. Uh, I want the O. If you'll just give that to me, please. There we go, okay. Thank you, game. For giving me that oh, now I gotta dodge the red bees. They are red because I, I don't know. I don't know why they're red. I, I don't really know what the distinction is between all the different bee colors. Not that it really matters. Maybe the yellow ones are... Well, I think I've seen stationary yellow ones. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, you know what it is? The red ones uh, can't be destroyed with like a, a barrel or anything like that. At least I think that's the difference. 
I don't know how I would be expected to go after that red one. Well, pink one, I should say. When it's like out in the middle of the pit, how would I get there with a barrel? Anyway, yeah. Gotta dodge all these bees. Oh, I got the corn. And I got the other extra life somehow. I'm racking up the lives here and then I just get hit straight on by a vulture. That's actually kinda hard. Lost one of those hard-earned lives. That's not good. Yeah, now they're just shoving bees in our faces. Which is never good. Nobody likes a bee in their face. And this rope just mysteriously moves all on its own. Yeah, see, I was obviously wrong because there are red ones that do move. I don't know. So let's try and get that. Yeah, that was a bad idea. I'm gonna pay for that. Oh god. Oh Jesus, I'm surprised I survived that. Let's just throw that there. No secret. Oh god. Too close for comfort. And here's the end of that level. We are moving along just fine. This is kind of a long world though. Now we're at Temple Tempest. We've still got a ways to go. At least a couple more levels, I think. Can I get up there? Yes, I can. For a rhino. Alright. Yeah, these things chase us now. So don't slow down. This isn't the last uh, chase level in a Donkey Kong Country game either. Just wait until I play 2 and then get to like World 4. I don't know when that's gonna happen, but yeah. So here's some ninja guys. How did I hit him? I land on like his chest. Oh, well, that guy came up out of a hole to chase us. Doesn't seem possible. 